Hello everyone, your sock monkey here. And today I'm begrudgingly filming the new Ford Ranger, even though I think they're terribly overpriced, but what the heck. Uh, starting off, you do have your halogen headlamps, by the way, it's down below. This is in black. Uh, you do have Ranger across right there. You do have front uh, parking sensors. You do have tow hooks. Um, black finished wheels, which are sort of nice. This is the XLT, uh, does have black, black finish mirrors, uh, blind spot monitoring, does have uh, infotainment, sync, um, does have four wheel drive, and an automatic transmission and a 2.3 liter EcoBoost. This is the uh, extended, this is the quad cab, extended cab, whatever you wanna call it. Fuel door is right here. It's got the capless fuel filling system. Uh, here's the bed light, here's the bed. It's the sport four wheel drive edition. Here's the, here's the box. Here's the bed, uh, the tailgate, it's lockable. It does have reverse sensing. EcoBoost, of course. Um, black wheels are nice. It does have some nice steps, but here's just what kills me about it. This is an XLT, and they want thirty-six grand for it. Thirty-six thousand dollars. That used two fifty over there. That uh, that two thousand and eight one is thirty-one, and they want thirty-six grand for this. It's it's insane, and you know people are wondering why they're not buying because you can buy a Tacoma for a lot less. And admittedly, I'm, I'm, and admittedly, I'm a bit biased because I've happened to drive a Tacoma. And I think the Tacomas are uh, awesome trucks. I have a very good friend with one. Just, and Merck Milano 6 just bought a Ranger and then immediately turned around and traded it in and bought an Audi Q5 TDI. Paid as much as this, you know, and the Ranger has... And the uh, Q5 is more torque than this thing. It's insane. I mean, I think Ford really took a swing and a miss on this truck. But there you have it. Thank you for watching.